Hi, this is Kushbu with another theorem of Euclid's geometry. This is theorem number 5.1 from NCRT page number 85. This says two distinct lines cannot have more than one point in common. I will prove that like two distinct lines, two different lines, they can have a common point. Ho sakta. Chai lines can be like this, chai can be like this, chai can be like but common points are like this. You have to prove that. So, you have given hai, two lines. Supposingly P and Q. And to prove that they have only one common point. In which the common points are A here. Proof. From let for let that the two lines, two points, but two different points are intersect. Karne. Let Lines P and Q intersect at two distinct points L and M. We have two points per intersect. So, this means that we have two points per intersect. So, basically, we have two different points, two distinct points. So, these lines are passing through two distinct points. So these lines are passing through two distinct points. So if we examine that, that only one point, that the two distinct points can have only one and only one point in common. So if you are talking about a line, it has only one, two distinct points, if you are talking about a line, so, a key point, a key point ho sakta hai uske paas. So, our assumption contradicts the axiom that there is one and only one, one and only one unique line. Unique line passing through two distinct points. Passing through two distinct points. So that means our assumption is wrong. So our assumption was wrong. Our assumption was wrong. Hence. Two distinct lines cannot have more than one point in common. Two distinct lines cannot have more than one point in common. So this was theorem number 5.1 from NCRT and do watch the next video for some more questions. Goodbye.